What's going on, Culture Heads? We're back for another amazing installment of Culture News today. We're currently posted here at Anthem Culture Headquarters, ACHQ. Been doing a lot of running around the city lately. A lot of meetings, a lot of developments with Anthem Culture, so it's a lot of interesting things coming up. So I'll keep you guys posted on that as they continue to progress. Shout out to everybody that's been subscribing to the newsletter, subscribing to the channel. I see everything coming through, so appreciate all the support. Look forward to a lot more content, definitely producing a lot more things, getting into a lot of new projects for the upcoming season. So make sure you keep it locked on AnthemCulture.com. And right now we're about to hop into the site, take a look at some new interesting stories around the world. So let's get to it. How many of you are fans of the movies and saw Martian? Um, those of you who did can recall the scene of Matt Damon pretty much stranded on Mars trying to grow potatoes <laughs> on in this new environment. So actually in real life, NASA is currently attempting to do the exact same thing. They found an area out in Peru and simulated the exact same conditions out in Mars from just temperature, soil, everything related to that. So now they're attempting to grow their own potatoes. So maybe if they're successful, we can begin farming on Mars. That would be real cool. So look for to more information on that and check that out on AnthemCulture.com. So there's a huge push out in India for this incredible campaign called Make in India. Present tense, Make in India. They're definitely trying to just establish a lot more sectors and development and growth and a lot of those one of them being fashion so they're now starting to boost a lot of garments and textiles just to really grow the industry and keep a lot of things homegrown and not only attract investments from foreign investors but also start to export a lot more things too so the rest of the world can appreciate what's coming out of India. So make sure you check more about that on AnthemCulture.com and support India. I'm a fan. <laughs> so one movie for the Oscars, Mad Max, I'm sure a lot of people are familiar with it. Well, they should be if they're familiar with the Oscars because they're nominated for 10 awards. And actually the film is significant because of a lot to do with, I guess the background scenes of it. It was shot in Namibia in the deserts out there. Incredible landscape, scenery, um, just overall vibe. And that's pretty much what created what you see and experience during Mad Max, along with dozens of other foreign films that's now starting to film a lot in Namibia. So definitely being put on the map. So make sure you keep checking more about that on AnthemCulture.com. And Maybe we'll post another film being shot out there, so keep posted on that. So the Qatar International Food Festival is rapidly approaching and they have an amazing contest actually for those of you who are artistic and creative when it comes to food as well. They're taking submissions currently for anybody that pretty much recreates a flag of their choice. It doesn't have to be your own flag, but just an interesting flag that you find and recreate it using edible items. So any type of food um, that lets you really play around with the different colors and shapes and stuff like that to really get the right molding. So make sure you check more about that on AnthemCulture.com and even instructions on how to submit your pieces to actually win a potential trip out to Qatar for the food festival. So make sure you read more about that on AnthemCulture.com. Thanks to wearable technology, fashion tech is pretty much becoming its own industry. And now fashion brands are starting to collaborate with technology companies. And where's the hub for that? <laughs> Out in the West Coast of the United States, downtown San Francisco, two companies joined together in order to form Codame Labs and um, actually the fashion mogul behind it, Anouk Wiprecht, is actually serving as the creative director for the entire project. So they're about to start investing in a lot of R&D just to really 
grow the industry and just expand their product base and line. So make sure you read more about that on anthemculture.com. Look out for the future. <laughs> Culture everything. News, information. We got it all. Anthem Culture. Make sure you continue to check out. Shout out to everybody that's subscribing and tell a friend to subscribe now. Tell them to subscribe to the newsletter and hop on anthemculture.com. You can subscribe straight to there and subscribe to these videos. Make sure you first on all of the culture information around the world. Stay updated on just news. Um, make sure you continue to check out Anthem Culture. It's a lot of things developing around the world, on the site with the company as a whole, starting to connect with a lot of different people. Shout out to everybody around the world that's been supporting Anthem Culture, uh, down to people rocking the bands, getting a bunch of tweets, uh, Facebook is buzzing a lot, everybody on social media, so make sure you check us all out all on that, backslash Anthem Culture. Shout out to all the culture heads, appreciate culture.